um, one of my next videos is going to be exploring the GERT board, the GPIO expansion card from GERT Van Lowe. Um, this semi-official card um, has quite a lot of soldering and quite a lot of small components on. So before I embarked on soldering this, what I got was one of these, which is the Adafruit Pi Cobbler, which is a, um, a breakout board that makes it much easier to connect up your Raspberry Pi to a breadboard um, than those small little uh, male to female jumpers I've previously used in other videos. So I got my um, Pi Cobbler from um, SK Pang. Um, in the UK, some of the Adafruit stuff can be a little bit tricky to get hold of in the UK. And um, what you're going to get is um, the pin uh, headers that will connect into the breadboard and the 26-pin uh, um, socket that will um, connect in your um, ribbon cable up to. Okay, so you're going to need to get hold of a soldering iron and some solder. And um, what you need to do is put the pin headers into the top and bottom slots, making sure that the small pin is facing up. Um, it can be a little bit wobbly, so try and stabilize it with a piece of foam. Um, and then what you want to do is solder in one pin on each side to stabilize it and make sure it's straight. So um, put a little bit of solder onto your soldering iron. And uh, what you'll see is you can then uh, just drop the solder onto the uh, pin and um, you'll see it actually hold the, um, the pin headers in place. So it should look nice and straight. Make sure that it looks very nice and straight like this before you solder all the rest of the pins in. Um, okay, so that's nice and straight. So what you want to do now is um, solder all the other pins in so that everything's connected. And then connect up the 26 pin um, socket and solder all those pins in as well. So where you would normally have these uh, male to female um, jumpers, you can swap them out for the Pi Cobbler. So you can just grab your Pi Cobbler and just insert it into your breadboard. It should align nicely and with a little bit of force, should just go in. And then you can connect up your ribbon cable from your Pi um, into your Cobbler. And that's a much, much nicer way of connecting up. So for me, what this means is I can actually get the lid back on my um, case and also can maybe look at getting a Pi Bow case or one of the Mod My Pi cases as well. Um, which are a much more of a sealed unit. So the Pi Cobbler was um, developed by Adafruit Industries. I uh, recommend you go and check out the website. They are a fantastic resource for all things Raspberry Pi, um, especially all the electronics and uh, additional components. And um, check them out. They've um, got some great stuff over there.